Alan Gelflin did the first no-handed errors way back in the late 70s on vert. His friends nicknamed him Ollie because of his fast skateboarding style. Street ollies were first done by Rodney Mullen in 1983. 17 years later, Danny Wainwright set the world record highest ollie at 44 and a half inches. And in 2002, Andrew Reynolds did the longest ollie, clearing 22 feet ramp to ramp. Stand on your board and rock back and forth to determine whether your trucks need to be tightened or loosened. Flip your board over and tighten or loosen your kingpin bolt as needed. A few suggestions I have for practicing ollies before rolling are on your grass, cracks in the sidewalk, welcome mats, or on your living room carpet if your parents permit. To ollie, place your front foot right behind your front truck bolts and just above the center of your board. Place your back foot on the edge of the tail with your heel hanging off and your toes on the opposite edge of the board. It's important that you are on the balls of your feet. As you bend your knees and begin to jump, force your tail to the ground while jumping at the same time. Imagine the response of your hand touching a hot burning stove. That is the same response you want from your tail snapping off the ground. As you relax your front foot, slide it up towards the nose of your board. Your front foot guides and lifts your board into the air. Your back foot must rise to the same height as your front foot leveling out your ollie. With your knees still bent, land on all four wheels to absorb the impact of your landing. When you feel confident that you have this trick wired, you can try it up curbs, down curbs, on banks, on quarter pipes, and half pipes, and anywhere else that you can imagine. The ollie is the one trick that will take you 